Hi everyone, I'm Kyla and I'm here to show you a dynamic warm up. Now this is okay to do on its own or paired with another one of my videos. It's just a great way to get the blood flowing and so you can properly move with whatever you need to do. So let's get started. We'll take a wide stance. All 10 toes face forward. Take a big inhale, reach up and down. Good, inhale, reach up and down. Again, inhale, reach up and down. Head roll, go ahead and take your time nice and slow. Softness in your knees and breathe. Nice, reverse direction. Good job, y'all. Nice, roll your shoulders back and down. Back and down. So I like to start kind of like top to bottom, getting warm. You have four, three, two, reverse direction, circling forward. Nice. Good, reach and circle. Two more. Last one, reach your hands high. Let me give you a cute little side view. Go ahead and reach, long spine. You can soften your knees if your hamstrings are tight. Release, bend your knees, roll yourself up. Couple more, reach, release, bend your knees, roll it up. Good, two more, reach, release, bend your knees, roll it up. Nice one, nice one, reach. <laughs> I meant to say last one. Roll it up, oh my goodness. Go ahead and stay standing. Bring your hands on your hips. And if you've watched SpongeBob before, yes, SpongeBob, you'll recognize this. And I do not remember the episode this was in, but I do remember that he said, bring it around town. You know what, it might be the bubble blowing episode. If you did not watch SpongeBob, I'm so sorry, you have no idea what I'm talking about. And that's okay. <laughs> The point is we're getting into our hips. Go ahead and reverse direction. So this feels really good all in my hip sockets and in my hamstrings where I'm feeling kind of tight today. Good. Nice, last one. And center. Go ahead and make your way to the back of your space. Drop your head, roll all the way down and walk out to a plank position. Wrists under shoulders, straight line from the crown of your head to the backs of your heels. You'll lift to a downward facing dog and plank. Lift and plank. Good, lift and plank. Core stays strong, lift and plank. A couple more here, lift and plank. Last time, lift and hold the plank, step one foot forward, lunge. Reach your hand up, twist, hand down, and back. Other leg steps forward, and reach, down, and back. Maybe you speed it up, lunge, twist, down, and plank. Lunge, twist, down, and plank. Keep breathing, lunge, twist, down, and plank. You've got this, lunge, Twist. One more, both sides, here we go. Yes, y'all. Last one. Reach and plank. Hold here, inhale, exhale. For four, three, two, knees down. Roll it out, maybe walk your hands back to your knees, give your wrists a little roll out, because we'll be on them for a little bit longer. Come to all fours, wrists under shoulders, knees under hips. If you have wrist injuries, you can come to fists or roll your mat back and let your hands hang off the edge. That helps as well. But I will be here. Extend your right leg back, tuck your right toes and start pressing into your heel. Right off the bat, I want you to really engage your core, protect your low back. Good, lift your right leg up, ground down through your right palm and reach your left fingertips forward. You'll draw knee to elbow and reach. Good, knee to elbow and reach. Two more, contract and reach. Last one, contract and reach. Hold for four, three, 
two, left hand down, right leg down, other side, left leg back, tuck your toes, press into your heel to start engaging your core. Lift your left leg up, ground down through your left palm, reach your right fingertips up, knee to elbow, and reach. Good, contract, and reach. Couple more, contract, and reach. Last time, contract, and reach. Hold, hold, hold. Good, right hand down, left knee down. Take a moment, kind of circle it out here. Good, breathe into it. Go ahead and reverse. Nice. All right, back to center. Walk your hands to your knees. Swing your feet out in front of you. We'll get into our core. So plant your feet parallel hip width distance. Hands behind your thighs to start. You'll roll all the way down. And peel all the way up. Good, all the way down. And all the way up. Good, you do not have to use the backs of your legs if you don't need the support. But roll downs and roll ups are oftentimes a little more challenging than they seem. So you can grab on to your thighs if needed. Good, last one. And roll up. Good, you'll lower halfway. And lift, open your arms halfway. And lift, open your arms, yes. So finding a little lift in our chest. Core is engaging and getting nice and warm. Couple more. <sighs> Last one. And lift. Go ahead and inch your booty a little closer to your heels. Roll all the way down. Pull up your pants if you need to. Hands by your sides. Feet are parallel hip width distance. Tuck your tailbone and peel your spine all the way up off the floor. Nice. Melt your spine all the way down. Keep your shoulders relaxed. I have a personal tendency to tense up my shoulders, even in nice slow bridges. So I have to actively remember to release them. Good. Melt all the way down. Nice, couple more. And down. Last time, keep your hips lifted. Little pulses up. And lift, fire up your back body. Relax those shoulders and breathe for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Keep your hips lifted. March your legs. You'll lift left and down and right. Down if you need, you can keep your knees bent. You do not have to extend them. But you're finding warmth throughout your body, especially your back body and core. Reach. And reach. Let's find four more. For four. Three. Two. And last one. Melt your spine all the way down. Pull your right knee into your chest. Tuck your chin, lift your shoulders, extend your left leg. You'll switch left, right. Thinking length through your toes as they reach and length through the crown of your head towards the back wall. And in. Just eight. Just six. And four, three, two, one. And rest. Little rock side to side. Take a moment. Circle your legs in your hip sockets. Good. Maybe extend one leg. My hips like to crack there. Hands behind your thighs. Rock yourself up to seated. Turn yourself around to all fours. Tuck your toes, lift your hips, downward facing dog. And walk your hands to your feet or your feet to your hands either way. Bend your knees. Roll all the way up to standing. Restack your spine. Your head is the last to lift. Take a big inhale and exhale. And you are ready to move on with your workout, your day, or whatever you have planned. Thank you so much. And if you like this video or have any questions, go ahead and comment right underneath or find me on Instagram at dancerkyla. And if you 
like my videos, please like and subscribe. Thanks y'all. Bye.